Last time on Metal Gear Rising, Revenge. Kid, what are you doing in the sewers? They're no machine's blood. You got more than like me? Oh man, this is getting out of hand. God damn it, George! You not want a die-hard ninja man? Then I guess I'll have to show you the director's cut. Man, I love Bruce Willis. Welcome back to Metal Gear Rising, Revengeance. Oh, and remember, our goal this year is 50,000 subscribers by the end of 2024. So hit that like button, and a little secret, if you subscribe right now, the subscribe button will glow rainbow. Go on, try it. I know you want to. Anyways, let's get right into it. We're on our way to Denver. That's right, the supercar. Is Big Wolf in the back? I wish. Baffled by the statement, police are still investigating a motive. President Hamilton is on his way to the Middle East this morning for his scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farooq Salam. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the region. Yo, me ninja brother. Hey, George. Good to see you up and about. How you feeling? Never better, nah. No pain, no more fast while them hunger space eat, and me never ever feel so awake, nah. That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. <laughs> Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh, me been here you go while I got them scone in the base. Why the rasa you not take me with ya, huh? Damn so why is going on? Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought you didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but. Killing isn't fun in games. Remember that. Right. <laughs> That's all I needed to hear. There it is. No! It yearns to bathe in the blood of your enemies, but you hold it. That's what I was saying last episode. Is that dichotomy? Yeah, just remember that. Whoa! Come on, man! Don't damage the window. When who told them the bike was gonna be here? Does Despado know? Wouldn't put it past them. They're pretty powerful. Private, what is this Gamnia? You cannot resign. Oh, <laughs> of course, it's done. Can't have a Maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now, can we? You could at least come talk to me. No. <laughs> it was time to break away from the old team, Boris. Past time. You cannot take on Marshall all by yourself. I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their parts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, right? They import those brains legally. For medical purposes, it's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Right. I agree with both of them. Oh, damn right. <laughs> Alright, Golden Freeman, calm down. Average Denver citizen. Sorry if you're from Denver, I, I apologize. <laughs> oh, there's the dog. Let's go. Calculated? Rocket League? That was not a great musty flick. I actually quite like how it's a parallel of like right at the star when he kicks the door open. Except it's upside down this time. Ahead. It's almost like his lawfulness has been turned on its head, you know what I mean? Military cyborg! You are not licensed to operate in this area! You're in violation of state and federal law! Way, way. Guess you'd better arrest me then. <laughs> <laughs> Why are we laughing? 183104.7, threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. 
Lovely. Cause Deadly Falls is all you're gonna get. Come on, boys. Don't tell me. Uh, oh wait, that's an arm. Did I get the arm? I probably messed it up, didn't I? I totally messed it up. Shit. Man, I was having too much fun slicing someone. Oh! oh, the dude, he's coming in hot. He was. Is that a grenade? Is that? What is that? There's a fellow behind me. Oh, it's a car exploding. I just wanted it. No, I didn't pick it up. What is exploding? Oh, it's this guy. I'll take that, thank you. I'll also take that one. Give me, give me, give me, damn it. Not a great start, but you know, we'll take it. Nice! Leave him right under the arm. Oh yeah, we'll just, we'll just, uh, turn that guy into sushi. 254 parts! Good stuff. Alright, any secrets? Any goodies for me? I don't think so. Let's continue on. Oh, Val came around the corner. Not my decision, buddy. I think you're the one who's cornered here. Oh, wait, I haven't, I haven't equipped the Latrange. Latrange? I, I'm still so confused by that name. Uh, hold on. Let's just, uh, there we go. The pole arm is what I should be calling it. Yeah, breakdance riding. Yeah, that's sick. Get him. That is such a fun weapon, man. Makes Ryan look so cool while using it as well. Let's see what we get. A rank. I'll take it. Oh, the road hey, is dog. By barricades. We will proceed through the buildings. You will follow me. Good stuff. I need to be aware of enemies. Oh. Ain't no way there's two of them from last episode. I know how to take him on this time. That I think these are slightly weaker versions. These are like actual public versions. Oh, I'm a launch! Other oh, fella, you ain't supposed to try and deal with this fight. It's meant to be an horrible 1v1. Good lord, even in the horrible 1v1, I'm getting swashed. No, thank you, buddy. I'll take those arm plates off. Oh, dance on him, right? Dance on him! Dance on him! He's so cool. I love Reels of Nature, man. Such a good theme. Here we go! Front plate off. Over the top! There we go. Oh. Come on. We should have closed that distance without getting shot. Nice. Nice. Stay close. Nice! That was a good parry hit. Nice! Spin alarm! They can't handle it. Here we go again! A slice! Ah, oh, slippity, 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 skippity, toilet. <laughs> Why did I say that? <laughs> nice, is that all? It was. Nice. Only one Zandatsu for the B rank, but, eh, I'll take it. HQ, oh. requesting this don't be dead oh. for Nah. I'm gonna do my own thing. Ooh. <laughs> No, the enemy has not been sighted. The only thing that's been sighted is your guts on the pavement, buddy. Delightful. Alright, there's a lot of folks out here, including a guy with a left arm. Let's see, where is he? There. Let's see if we can get a drop on him. Yep, we sure did. 
I want his arm. Did I not count his arm? That's bull. Oh. Shit. You were not meant to see that, buddy. God damn, Ryan, calm down! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> he looks like he's doing a goofy dance. During your last fight, the caller's position is on your solitone radar. You can oh, okay. engage if you wish. It is your choice. My choice, Boris. I mean, you know, I'm always in for a little bit of roughhousing. Your route through Denver has been plotted based on data culled from various security systems. I took the liberty of adding a guidance device to your chassis to ensure you do not stray too far. Andy, eh? Thanks, Doctor. Alright, who's here for me then? Here comes more of them. Lovely! Oh, I love this song. Oh, yeah! <laughs> they can't do anything. Ow! Big guy can't, though. Oh, there we go. Oh, no one can hit me. Oh, I'm on top of him. Oh! Take that arm off. This guy's getting juggled. Good lord, Raiden. Oh, my god! He's so sick. <laughs> Come on, take off those arms. There we go. Local sword man cannot use sword anymore because he has no arms left to use them. Put your mouth already, man. Come on. Thank you. I'll take that. What? <laughs> Bro turned into a ghost with his dying breath, he tried to kill me. Also, I really got a combat rank B for that. Dude, I was I was slaying those dudes. Alright, that seems to be everything out here. Let's head on inside. Hello? Oh, what a nice little establishment. Oh, this place looks awesome. Oh, Boris? What's your status? They trashed my car. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. Do you really have to do this? Look, I'm fed up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Raiden. Boris, listen to me. That VR training. They'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. I'm doing this, Boris. I have to. I can't save those kids from becoming cyborgs, but I can stop them from becoming murderers. So you succeed. So you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know a great cybernetic surgeon. Doctor. But he cannot. You won't change my mind, Boris. This is my fight now. And your wife and son? What of them? They're in New Zealand. Safe. Rose would understand why I have to do this. <sighs> All right, damn you. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Yeah, we've met. Well then. <clears throat> Officially, Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. <laughs> now, increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially? I'll do all I can over the codec to help. Nice. I do not like what those mudaki are doing any more than you. Spasiba, Tavarish. Spasiba. Yeah, so it, it is what I was saying before. This has become so just personal to Raiden. I 100% see why. It's good that he has the people at Maverick actually helping him out, even though, like, you know, it's against their their laws and jurisdictions. Right. Time to work through these apartments, then. Nice little office setup. Nice. Whoa! Hey, I haven't seen you guys since one of the first missions! How you been doing? Woo! Spin around! Let's go! Swing! 
Oh yeah, slice them up, slice them up! <laughs> 413 parts! God damn, who is shooting me? I need to deal with that guy, because he is getting on my wick. Oh yeah, let's just deal with this guy first. There we go, let's slice him up into a million little itty bitty pieces. Yeah! <laughs> Bit of a bad camera angle to show it, but uh, that dude has just been replaced with dust. Ow! He can hold a gun now! He can hold a gun! That is an American gecko if I've ever seen one. Box? Oh, that's a box that I can actually use. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Also, nice A rank. We love to see it. Right. You will find an elevator inside that office. Use it to reach the roof. Elevator. Traveling atop buildings will minimize enemy encounters. Good stuff. Oh, hey fella. Sorry fellas, I gotta get through. One of you guys got a hand I want. Come get some! Nice, I got it. Time to grab the hand. Nice! Come on, just wear this guy's little wire shield down. Oh, he's waiting for him to make a move. There we go. Yeah, I move behind him in blade mode. Yo, a lot of people don't know you can actually just move around in blade mode. I just hold down the left stick and you're able to walk around a bit. It means you're not able to really, like, you know, aim as well, but... There we go. Good stuff. No damage. Let's go. S rank. Right. Elevator time. Doc, what's your status? I am reviewing the pre flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. Nice. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden <laughs> age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world martial security from the pilot seat. Well, as long as safe, Doc. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Good stuff. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data, the research. Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. <laughs> yeah, sure thing, Doc, sure thing. All right, it's a little bit scary. Uh... Oh, man. Oh, man. Flying guys, huh? Are they dropping reinforcements off, or are they just floating around? Come on! We know what I'm here for! There we go, come down, come down, come down! I can't really see him. There we go. I can't reach him still! Wait, what are you doing in the air? <laughs> Did I knock him up as well? Oh, that dude is getting destroyed! Holy crap! Oh, there he goes. A uh, slight. How do I deal with the other fellow then? Oh, wait, hold on. I have the perfect thing for this. Lovely! Not that one. That one. Pop. Bye! Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. What a goofy little weapon. Whoa! Raiden, Raiden, you silly Billy. You could have just sent us to our death. I couldn't decide whether I should say grave or death, so I said both. Death! <laughs> I love the Ninja Run Man. Such a cool addition. And what are you? Hello. Some BP. Gotta love it. Here comes another attack. What? Oh, man. Oh, so these guys finally decided to come and fight me on their own, huh? Nice of you to join the party. Get off. Oh, I hate those flying guys, man. Maybe, maybe I'm missing something to deal with them, because I'm having a really tough time fighting like those ones and the guys who can, like... Uh, grab it, you have to like wiggle the stick. Those ones I'm really struggling with. 
Hey, what's good up here? Oh, big armored boy. Oh, and more flying guys. It's a light. Another great song. Let's go. Oh yeah, yeah, we're we're messing them up real good now. Oh god damn it. There we go. I try to take his arms off. Let's take him out now. Nice! I couldn't even take his leg off. I'll take the bolt off now though. This dude just got dogged on. This, this combat can be really satisfying. It's just these guys, but you just can't quite reach them. That's why I think I must be missing something, because this game is very well made in terms of the combat. There's always an answer for everything. Maybe it's in one of those, like, skill upgrades I haven't gotten yet, but like... Oh, another one. Hey, buddy. Oh, nice. Style on him, style on him. Nice. Quick dodge. A slice. What is going on? Mine's a little bit too cool. Oh, he's so good. Ah, oh, such a satisfying game. Can I be through, please? Thank you. Let's see. Pen on a pace, we don't really need it. There is a fella up here though. Oh god damn it. Of course you turned around right there. Oh god damn it, that is an airplane. There we go. What if I'm using the MP grenade on this? Nice, it works! Slice! Nice! A lot better than in part one, I'll tell you that much. S rank, there we go, literally perfect. Except from, you know, not getting hit, but eh. even more flying guys. Ugh, what a pest. Alright. Let's see where this guy's off to then. This guy in front. Oh, there is a left hand there as well. I'm hoping I can just stealth take out this guy up here. Then maybe go around to the left. Throw some guys over a different way. Perfect. Go to sleep. Oh, I didn't mean it. That's my cover. I just accidentally sold through my cover. Which is supposed to be cops. What do they do? Some things World Marshal does not appreciate. You're on the company blacklist. No, 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 no! God damn it. I want the hand though. Nice. I'm sorry about the civilian, but like, you know, left hand. Are we gonna hit him off the off the edge of the roof? Oh, bye bye fella! <laughs> I hope he got parachutes or something, because like yeah, that that was really hurt. There we go. Bullseye! Good stuff. A little RPG, which is perfect for any flying guys, because I, I really don't like dealing with flying guys. Right, seems we're gonna have to head in through you here. Can't proceed any further via the rooftops. There is a freight railroad underground. The elevator ahead will take you to it. Good stuff, Blade Wolf. <laughs> nice. Hmm. Only one way down, huh? <laughs> Sick. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of the Appear so, yeah, if I could see it. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. 
This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah. Yeah. It's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. Yeah, open mode should be able to help us out. There we go. Only problem with this is trying to take out some really nasty enemies. Because you can't fight well in open mode. Which is really strange, honestly, but you know. Let's see. Alright. Oh, you're kidding me. These guys? The wiggly stick guys? They still have not noticed you. Do not expose yourself. Alright, Boris. Alright, I'm just chilling. Here we go. Oh, so I can see now? God, bro wants a hug. Nope. I'll take that arm. I can take the arm. No hugs for you. Where is he? Oh, he exploded into a pile of guts. Okay, never mind. Another guy up there? He's just hanging out. Having a good time. Yeah, I'm here for a fight. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... It's nice to actually, you know, lighten the place up a little bit while you fight these guys. My head canon is that these guys, like, emit some sort of, like, light from themselves. So you'll be able to, like, fight them while being able to see you. There's a lot of enemies on the map, actually, now I'm looking at it. It's a good thing we can take this guy out real quick. Here we go. Yeah. Good stuff. Get that Zantatsu waiting up. <laughs> nice. How many others are there? I I saw that. Is that them up there? Just some more dwarf geckos? Okay, as long as there isn't a ton of those big guys, I'm going to be fine. Hey, fellas. What is that noise? That did not sound very warm and welcoming. Is there another guy up there? Just another dwarf echo. I'm fine. I'm just worried it's gonna be another one of those monkey guys. I really dislike them. Though, I mean, I did deal with them a bit better there. It's just they're really annoying with their grabs. There we go. Any more in here? Of course there is. There's always a bigger fish. And with that, there's always a bigger fryer. Oh, that went up his ass! Raiden, you didn't have to do that to him! God damn! What is that? Is that an RPG? Oh. Oh, it's another one of these guys. The the double guys. Look! I Why are these here? I've never seen these before in the game. It's pretty bad that I can't see them in the dark. Nice! That was a good parry, especially being in the dark. Oh. That is honestly really disgusting, right? I hope you get some serious help with that. Nice. This has been a really interesting section, honestly. Kind of prioritizing stealth a bit more. Like, you can always run, hack, and slash through it, which is really funny. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? No way! Oh my god, no way! Oh, I just managed to get them off in time. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me! A D rank. Ugh. What was I even saying? But right, yeah, you can run hack and slash through it. But you know, I guess sometimes the game just wants to drop a bunch of geckos on you and say, hey, sort it out yourself. Jump scan simulator. All right. There we go. This should be the way out. Yeah, nothing back there. Right. There we go. Appear, your only way forward is to return to the surface. You will exit into an evacuated commercial district. Security is heavy, but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the enemy. Good stuff. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. 
Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Good. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. <laughs> I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I <laughs> do not find them Oh, entertaining. come on, throw him a bone. Grab another one of these. I wonder if we've collected all of these so far, because I feel like we've been doing a very good job of kind of collecting all like the little side content bits and pieces. Right. You no one may have probably... Uh oh! Big guy! God damn, everyone else is rushing at me. Meanwhile, I'm just trying to catch up with this thing. Oh god! No, 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 no! Good lord, I can't! I'm getting sauced! What's wrong? Come on, buddy, answer me! Right it? I am flabbergasted! Jeez, man! Okay. I gotta think about this. What if I go out with this? Right. You have almost this don't me. Yeah! Okay, my idea is to get underneath the bridge, take out these guys, and then go for the big guy. He shouldn't be able to shoot through the bridge. Oh, he can! That's an arm I see on the guy on the left! Oh, hold on. I'm coming towards you, buddy! Oh! <laughs> hey! Whoa! Hey! I need that arm. Give me. Give, hold on. This is a really awkward angle. Um. Shit. It appears there are enemies on the overpass. I suggest cutting the road supports. That should bring it down. That sounds like a great idea, bud. Nice! Take out some more supports. Spinny. Oh, there we go. Going for the kill this time, right? Yeah! Good stuff. A lot better than our last attempt, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Alright. Oh, am I just gonna quickly tally up our combat rank? Yeah, I'll take combat rank B. That wasn't exactly the smoothest the thing. Avoid fighting if you can. All right, let's see what we got here then. And, oh, it's another arm guy. How do I get around these then? I take out the guy on the top, and then I go for the guys on the bottom. Hey, buddy! Can I have your hand? Not in marriage, but you know. Did I get it? Nice. That's what I've been waiting for. Come on, let me let me use my. There we go. Guy on the right. Yeah, other dude is not listening to you, man. Imagine having this going behind you, you just don't hear a single thing, including the guy saying bullseye. I can't believe they removed the ears from these guys. Kevin? Why, why did you say that? Alright, shopping district, huh? Ooh, a lot of guys here, including another left hand. Hey, boys! Hey, oh, I couldn't get him. Hey, I got it first time. Inferior blade wolf spotted. Where's the dog? What's the dog doing? Oh, firing laser cannon. Got it. I much prefer the blade wolf variant. I'll be real. A camera, please. Woo! Good stuff, A rank. Whoop! There we go. All right, that was some good stuff. What the hell is that? What the? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why is that here? I'm gonna play that. Holy shit! Oh my god! Sam, why'd you put that on the window, man? Jetstream Sam. I heard you chop the land collector in half. Old habits die hard, Jack. But now here you are. The child stole. Fighting for the children. <laughs> Please. What do you really expect to accomplish here? Play Sam here to a bunch of brains? But you are a man of 
Well, if someone doesn't back down from violence, you're gonna have to stop them somehow. My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? When you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> <laughs> into the hamburger? Adults, they made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, they signed up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down? Pumped full of fear inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender? Your blender? But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nanos press. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. fact that Ryan's trying to protect people because of those people. It's the people who are signing them up for the job that are creating the conflict. And that's exactly what Desperado is. I, I honestly think that Sam is trying to help Ryan in this case. He's trying to push him beyond the edge. Commenting on the fact that these people are having literal midlife crises as they're being chopped up in a sushi, but like, you know. I like also how they're throwing like the weakest enemies at you to make you feel bad. Unfortunately, I have a quarter to meet and he's scored again. Oof. Not bad. A rank. Raiden, are you injured? I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Whoa, whoa, Manipulating whoa. mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. Uh, no, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind is not among my defined directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? That's what I'm saying. Affirmative. We served together on three previous missions. Interesting. He proved most capable. You think highly of him. I have always found him 
dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. That's what I'm saying. It feels like Sam is trying to help Raiden in his own unique way. You follow. He's almost trying to like sculpt him into a better fighter. It's really interesting. Raiden, your current emotional state appears highly volatile. Oh, crap. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission, but I suggest you avoid combat for the time being. All right, boss. Yeah, there's two guys out here, so I'm just gonna toodle on past them. I, I don't think that you can, um, what you call them, fight them. Where's the other fellows? One there. He's walking the other way. That's good. Let's just toodle on over here. World Marshal. But on its literal front doors. Is that a guy just in front of the- oh god damn it. I think this is gonna be like something we're gonna have to fight this guy. Or just try to like walk past him, I think. <laughs> is that even gonna work? Oh wait, hold on. He just so happens to be walking away from where we need to go! Thank you fella, thank you. I know you're on the side of good. And there's two guys just up ahead. Hmm. Does that mean all these guys are gonna start running after me once these guys get loaded? Cause I think so. Oh boy, here we go. There we go. There we go. Ow! I guess I don't have heavies. I don't have any sort of ninja run. Ryan, get yourself together, man. I'm gonna hide in a drum can if you're not careful. Ouch! Come on, Ryan. Nah, he, he's a- he's gonzo. He's absolutely horn swaddled. This is just like Jetstream Sam's fight all over again. Oh, wait, no, there he is! Sam! Hey, buddy! Hello. I was just talking about you. How you doing? Hey, uh, you see these other guys? Not so black and white now, is it? Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? <laughs> Why? Why is he saying stuff like that? He's saying like one-liners. God, I love that character. I'm pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. Who the hell are you? My name is Monsoon. Oh, thanks for introducing yourself. <laughs> the winds of destruction. Yeah, I guessed as much. So the Death Rider enforces the winds of destruction. Whoa! Hey. All right, Mr. Magnet Man. <laughs> Feasting on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your But who is this guy? He shows up, becomes a bunch of salami. So and who then he just starts like lecturing the man me. Who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Yeah. Kill or be killed, Jack. The not pen taught me that. He is literally just a little sundowner. Yes, you aren't the only one to grow up on the killer. War is a cruel parent, but an effective teacher. Its final lesson is carved deep. These guys are nuts, man. This world if every other encounter didn't sell you on it. Free will is a myth. Religion is a you, Sam, are you listening to this guy? What what is he going on about? Memes. The DNA oh. of the soul. Memes? They are the culture. They are everything we pass. God, he's literally a soldier. Someone to anger long enough. All right, mate. Uh, oh, cat. Become a carrier. Envy, greed, despair. All means. No, don't hurt him. How about shit? Yeah. Does that mean you can't fight nature, Jack? 
Wind blows, rain falls, and the strong I'm sorry, I... Upon the weak. I, I really like the cat. Sam tells me you see your weapon oh. as a tool. Something that saves lives. You're a tool. Of justice. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lives you take. Absolved you of guilt when you enjoy it. Oh, checkpoint. That is until the illusion was broken. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make, nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. You're I right. really don't like that guy. About He's okay. me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak. But I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good. Really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! Whoa, hey, hey, whoa. The bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. You? Oh no. But you, all this is a wake-up call to what I really believe, what I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Doctor, turn off my pain and There it is. What? This, this is madness. You do it. All right. There it is. Pain. This is why I fight. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that's this metal. Is my normal. My nature. You've lost your mind. No, are you kidding me? I totally parried that. No, you get him off. No, you're kidding me. I'm having a rough time. Oh my god. We have to like skip parts. I 
I'm messing up on the simplest bits, you know what I mean? I can easily take this guy out with not too much, like, effort, but, like... I don't know, maybe it's, maybe it's the fight I'm commentating. I'm gonna try it without. My what's been cut off? My meat's been cut off? Okay, I'm gonna take you off. This one's on me! Yada yada yada. You know, considering these bosses are actually so tricky, I would actually quite like to see like maybe in a sequel game that they can have different voice lines like randomly put into the bosses. Just that means that every time you may be hearing something a little bit different, even if, like, you know, you are feeling a bit. Magnetic power! Come on. Doing some good work here. I'm just gonna have to focus on this last bit.
damn. I'm running into something there. Maybe it isn't that I'm running to. Oh, there's like literally like one remnant of the other one left. Here we go! Focus up now! He stunned me? Couldn't even see him. Oh, again. You are kidding me. How many this time? Holy crap! Here we go! Come on! Yes! Get all of them! We're gonna go for a third one or he's coming down? Alright! This one again. Crap! I have to take these. Nice! Crap. Come on. Come on. Again. You sure? That's different. There's more fire coming out of it. No, 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 no! Come on, it's almost over. Come on. Just a bit more! This is it! I'll put you under, weakling. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go over. Now what do you do? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Take him down. Oh, what a fight. 27 minutes. Kill. Or be killed. Bro, you're literally your head on the floor. Ashamed. It's only nature running its course. Cold. Your beams. And here. God damn it, he's a, he's a dank Mame guy. One. To you. Sure as the sun will rise. The slaughter will continue. Yeah, I doubt that. Now, I return to the earth. Wind blows. Rain falls. The strong prey on the weak. All is as it should be. What a fight.
fight. Raiden? I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later. Thanks, Kev. God, I wouldn't want anyone to fight uh, Monsoon either, because that was rough. <laughs> I used to play this game a lot back in the day. Oh, I say back in the day, I mean like maybe like two, three years ago. Uh, I was a lot better. But hey, we did it. B rank, yeah. That, that single D rank really just took the whole thing down and... Honestly, I'm quite surprised I got as decent of a rank as I did on the boss fight, considering, uh, <laughs> yeah, literally 27 minutes of that one hour eight was literally just fighting Monsoon. Man, what a guy, what a boss. As Raiden dons his best Raphael cosplay, he must traverse World Martial HQ to finally save those brains. Will Raiden save the kids? Will we finally fight Sam or Sundowner? Or will Raiden finally be bested by customer services? Find out on the next episode of Metal Gear Rising Revenge. What even is the Raiden voice? Okay, I'm, I'm a bit more Raiden now.